fire signs welcome to my channel Polly here uh, if you're new to the channel you're very welcome to my channel if you are coming back thank you for trusting and coming back to my channel so today we're doing something a little bit different okay so we're working with the fire signs in one video only so we're doing Aries Leo Sagittarius in one go okay of course we're gonna get separate cards for the tree and see what do they need to know and what advice do we have from mermaids oracle and the wisdom of the oracle but for now let's get two cards for the tarot for aries for this april 2021 <clears throat> okay we have strength and we have justice so now let's clarify these cards with this minor arcana here they want to jump so let's get something here strength and justice strong cards here okay very strong cards <clears throat> fiery cards so there's a lot going on there for Aries at this moment but it's not bad Okay, there's definitely something here going on and we're going to have a look in a second. There's just some um, need for alignment here. Could be alignment in terms of um, mental and emotional because you have the strength and you have the balance there for the justice. Um, let's see. Let's see, Aris. Ten of coins six of wands as i said it looks good it feels good it looks good so we have the strength with the ten of coins ten of pentacles here so you are definitely following your instincts okay again this this strength card is very strong this is a very strong person this could be some of you are finally following your heart you stop thinking so much about other people and start <clears throat> more thinking about you okay how can you dominate your energy towards others manipulate your energy towards others towards your fulfillment towards your happiness okay at all levels and it's funny because especially this time while i'm looking at this card all it's coming out of me it's the tulips and this is actually the tulip season where i am so definitely the spring here brings a lot of fulfillment and happiness and and strength to this um to the aries people here okay there's something about the connection your creativity the way you talk the way you you defend yourself the way you you speak your truth to others okay the way you open yourself i feel like a lot of finally being myself finally being who i am and not trying to please others as a lot of you always try to do okay and this justice with the six of wands there's definitely here a lot of recognition this could also be maybe in in maybe a job maybe a contract maybe some paperwork you have to deal with as well there's there could be some um legal paperwork that you've been working on or if you have some situation there's definitely a victory here okay there's a recognition here there's um winning something maybe it's it's a job that you wanted so much or maybe even maybe it's a relationship okay maybe you've been fighting for a relationship for feeling something inside you and finally the victory is yours here there's a lot of happiness for you this month iris this feels beautiful it feels open energetic it feels exciting this is all i'm feeling right now so let's see what the mermaids have to say for aries like just from 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 this cards here i feel i feel excitement i feel a lot of happiness here you know a lot of well-deserved happiness here so we have one card so far we have visions psychic images um and the song of the siren okay so this card says visions psychic images clairvoyance seeing out of body travel now for me of course for some of you this is definitely you being yourself opening yourself it could be in the during the full moon 
all right it could definitely be uh, it could be maybe when you're by the sea okay because it's you see so much blue again uh, it's curious because i mentioned with this ten of pentacles here i mentioned the color blue your your throat chakra and this all comes in so much blue so definitely you are envision yourself you are looking at yourself you are you are feeling you are expressing and this feels beautiful and then here we have song of the siren to knowledge the call so this is your call you're you're finally putting yourself out there the way you are and the way you want others to see you okay because you are just this beautiful mermaid full of um qualities and skills okay and all you want to do is just expose that to the world okay show who you really are not who others want you to be you are finally in this um reality in this authenticity of course you're also in your own seasoners and this could also assist you as well um with this uh new you if we can put it that way because what i feel is that some of you has been struggling for quite a while and now you're finally do you know what i had enough of this this is who i am and i'm just gonna be myself if you like me it's the way i am <clears throat> okay <clears throat> sorry now let's see what the wisdom of the oracle also has to say to Aries for the month of april of 2021 I'm going to take as well two cards here. So we have unfinished story and young. Again, action, a lot of action, a lot of fire, a lot of um, being proactive here. But first we have this unfinished story. Okay. This is a very specific. I'm trying to see if I can show you better. This is um, a very specific m message for some of you. Okay. If you've been going on and on and on, in and out with some sort of situation, whether this is a job, this is um, a family issue, a relationship issue, um, or anything like that, maybe an emotional issue, okay? It's time to get over with, okay? It's time to... Uh, because until you finish this situation, until you, you learn the lesson from what you need to learn, things going to keep coming back to you, Okay? Even if it's a job, if it's a behavior, it's going to keep coming back to you. Not with the same people, not with the same energy, not with the same situations, but they will all lead to the same sort of feeling, of emotion, of attitude, of behavior, okay? So when you finally learn the lesson for this and that's it, you, you, you finish that, you learn the lesson and you're ready to move on, things will finally move on for you and you will get this 10 of pentacles here okay and we have card number one young young a male strong energetic proactive energy it's time to take action again it's 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 here that you're gonna take action i feel this april so so strong for aries it's so much that you're gonna take ownership of who you are and you you're just gonna be yourself you, you're definitely out of this okay so i i need to be like this i need to stop being myself to please this that and that and that no 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 enough of that it's time to be me oh this is great this is great aries so this is the messages for you for this month and now we are jumping into leo okay so leo what are the messages for you for the month of april for the month of april 2021 messages for leo what does leo need to know please give me two cards that express the energies for leo okay and that's it so for Leo, we have the hanging man and we have the fool. Let's clarify this card here. Now, Leo, it looks like you need to 
take a different approach in some situation in some energetic situation some vibration in your life but let's see here better let's clarify this okay yeah two of wands and ten of cups so what do we have here we have the hanging man with the two of cups there's definitely here the need to take a new approach to see things from a different perspective uh, maybe there's the need to um, balance your life in a different um, way or for some of you as well there's some um, decision need to be taken here so for you to make that decision you need to ponder different stuff you need to take a new perspective you need to see things from a different uh, side maybe you're too much inside the situation you need to look from the outside so that you can make this decision better okay to find the balance here because you see here it's like um the time stopped and it just dropped and everything dropped all the coins the mask everything dropped and it's like you need to let go of everything you need to let go of what doesn't serve you, you need to let go of that that it's causing you pain so that you can finally be yourself and make your own decision okay and we also have the fool and the ten of cups again the fool it's a lot of ideas um living your own life living your own dreams um just just again take only what res what what resonates with you okay because look at this hanging man i just told you just drop everything and what is the fool the fool just takes exactly what he needs and he just goes through his mind it, like the dog is trying to say listen hold on there okay but the funny thing here is that the dog normally is, of course is the sign of loyalty of everything but what i'm feeling here is that once you follow your dreams and you just follow what you really want to you're going to accomplish this harmony discomfort the, the happy home okay so there is a there is a lot going on here for leo for this month okay maybe some as i said before a lot of decisions need to be taken you need to realize what you want to do and and stop holding just because of what other people say to you okay it's time to listen to yourself to listen to your heart to listen to your soul to do what makes you feel good not what other people feel good what makes you feel good you could be tired of some situation here and you just want to go and you just want to um just say listen i don't care about that i just want to go okay there's a lot of emotions here because you have the hanging man there's a, a pisces card you have the ten of cups a pisces card as well so there's a lot of emotion here there's a lot of wanting to go within wanting to be yourself only okay stepping away from everyone and look for yourself finding yourself okay so let's see here what the mermaids have to say guide okay a mentor a trustworthy ally a, um so there could be some of you needing to have a mentor or maybe needed to talk to someone and um so but when i mean someone it's not someone just any person okay someone that you trust because that's why i mentioned here a guide a mentor a coach okay maybe a teacher someone that you really resonate with okay someone that the chemistry is is it's amazing and you can you can fully trust that person so it will assist you to making this decision finding this balance here okay and then we have the return of aphrodite temple birth of the goddess guidance goddess energy treating as sacred look at her she has a key look at this two of wands there is a key as well here okay so what does this tell me you have to listen to yourself okay you have the guidance inside you to decide where to go okay you have the sun inside you and you see this dolphins here this also makes me feel like you're taking life so serious 
that they're asking you have some fun okay have some fun with yourself connect to your goddess connect to your inner guidance okay connect to your inner child connect to your own energy okay step away from others because look at this energy there's a white i don't know if you can see it's very bright the card okay so there is a dove here okay it's beautiful and and curiously this card is number 13 13 in the tarot of course it transformation so the transformation to listen to yourself okay there's definitely here some changes some decisions some transformation that needs to happen in leo's life this month okay and finally let's have a look at the wisdom of the oracle and see what are the final messages for leo final messages for leo okay so we have why co-create and peace found finding your why it's gonna give you all the answers that you need okay maybe look in a book maybe ask your angels and um, it's important to for you to figure out why are you doing this why are you making this decision why do you want to make this decision what is bringing you okay this this your why it's gonna help you so once you get that that um answer it's gonna assist you to co-create co-create why because we are all one we are all energy here so we are co-creating here with the universe to be a better person maybe you are co-creating with someone else okay because look at this there's an egg here there's a lot of wisdom there's a lot a new beginning there's the owl here a lot of wisdom and a lot of um strength a lot of power okay uh, it's it's like timeless here but we you have everything inside you and you could even use that with someone else to work on this um new project i feel this is a new project that you want to do here this decision here that you're going to make for some of you okay and this peace card again on the same line it's a dove here as well there's a dove here there's a dove with the mermaid there's definitely a lot of peace coming towards you and this new project that you're working on it's going to bring you a lot of peace and curiously, I'm just realizing now that this first card has the same stains in the egg as it has in the animal. So there's a there's a big connection here, okay? There's there's someone definitely that's gonna help you to get to, to create this stability, to have a stability in your life and to make these great decisions and look through to find your peace, to find your abundance, to find your happiness, okay? Well, Leo, this is what I have for you for this month. I do hope you have a wonderful month. And now we are going into Sagittarius. Sagittarius, let's get the messages for Sagittarius. The most important, relevant and needed messages for Sagittarius. Please give me two cards that transmit the most important messages for Sagittarius for this April 2021. I do hope you're all safe Sagittarius. I just felt I needed to say this for some reason and let's see what do we have here for you. We have strength and we have death. Okay. Let's clarify this for Sagittarius, please. One more. Now, let's see. Sagittarius, please clarify the strength and the death cards. Strength, we have the Six of Cups. Okay, Sagittarius. Um, there's there's a lot of energy here that you want to follow your dream you want to follow your spirituality you want to follow um, something like your childhood dreams 
like normally this six of cups here brings me the childhood dreams you know or you can do anything that you want maybe for other people with the strength because the strength is like this this person that can actually dominate this um strong and fast um animals so she has a lot of power within and this power within comes with a lot of um imagination creativity that's what i'm getting here and this death has the king of coins okay so there's a lot there's definitely here like following your dream working a hundred percent on what you want to do okay because the strength again here she works she has a lot of um self-power okay inner guidance like look at the colors it's all about gold it's so fiery here okay so there's a lot of um strength here and she's very strong as well to dominate her emotions okay because the six of cups it's emotions it's about your self-love as well so you have a lot of control in terms of your self-love okay and we have this death and the king of coins there are definitely some transformations happening in your life. Maybe something is finishing so other things can actually flourish. I'm definitely feeling here the end of something. Maybe the end of pain. Maybe the end of maybe something that doesn't serve you anymore. It could be a job. It could be a home. It could be a place. It could be a relationship. It could be you decluttering from your friendships or, or anything. Okay, Any sort of situation that doesn't serve you anymore. Because once you just leave this just cut out with this this is what's gonna come king of coins okay a lot of um abundance coming all right and this is exactly what i'm feeling a lot of abundance coming towards you once you finish this once you cut something that doesn't serve you anymore and there's it's it's coming it's giving me a lot of attention this that as in um you need to cut out something so that the new can come up okay because this in this death card you have here um a white rose okay i'm gonna try to show you here so you have a white rose despite all of the situation here so there's a need to something to finish so that the new can flourish here okay for this new abundance maybe there's something toxic in your life that needs to be cut out of but let's see what the mermaids have to say here for Sagittarius. Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarius. Sagittarius. One more and that's it. So let's see what we have. We have Song of the Siren. This card is coming for a lot of people and I'm shuffling so much. Yemaya, the grandmother ocean primordial okay giving priority to your own things your own projects your own baby look at her she's protecting this baby for me this is not just protecting a baby it could be for some of you but it could be as well protecting yourself your inner child okay protecting yourself from others listening to yourself okay speak your truth here we go song of the siren so listening to yourself listening to what's coming inside you okay listen to your own voice and protect yourself okay these cards are beautiful here for sagittarius because sagittarius is again so spiritual here okay and there's definitely when you <sighs> With this death, it's like it's protecting this part as well, this Yemaya here. Okay, so it's definitely protecting your dreams. And protecting your dreams, it's going to bring you so much abundance here. Let me see what the Wisdom of the Oracle have to say as well. like you're opening yourself again right. here and now okay living the present moment and <clears throat> walking in circles exactly 
first of all here and now okay living the present moment and this is what happens when you focus on yourself when you live according to yourself okay you open the gate for new opportunities because you're living right here you're listening to your own energy at this moment okay and this walking in circles here for me this card has as two clear meanings here okay it will of course it will work according to what it feels more for your energy at this moment you could also have a situation that keeps coming over and over and over because you're not ending the situation or for other people this is actually finally things taking its natural way for something better okay now this will depend of your current situation are you, whether you need to finish some situation are you working towards this or you still need to learn something and you're just not getting it okay so of course take what resonates with you okay Sagittarius so this is my uh, reading for you for this month I do hope you enjoy thank you all for listening to this reading and um, please like and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy this reading share with family and friends and until next time have a great month bye bye